Well, today is International Women's Day to mark the occasion. The One Colorado Shopping Center is highlighting female-owned businesses. Bob DeCastro is live in Pasadena now with more. Bob, good morning. Good morning. Yeah, it's one of those instances where I wish we had smell vision because you walk into this shop and you, the smells are incredible. We go, we go to restaurants a lot, but this almost smells like a spa because it smells so amazing. And we are at the Soap Kitchen. This is at One Colorado. These are all natural soap, soaps. And yes, on International Women's Day, we're shining a spotlight on female-owned businesses. This is Dali. She owns the shop here. You got your start at a, at a, at a really young age. This is a shop that's been here, by the way, for almost 20 years. And tell us about how you got your start. You, you basically started almost like in your own kitchen, right? Yeah, pretty much. Um, once I tried this type of soap, I was hooked and I couldn't go back to using anything else. So I taught myself how to make it and um, decided to open up shop. There's so much to see here. This, uh, These are all natural soaps, right? Yes. So t tell us the process, how this is made. So this is the old-fashioned way of soap making. We start with olive oil as our main ingredient. And um, and you actually have to introduce lye to the situation. But um, once the soap is fully cured, there's no more lye left in the soap. And we use only essential oils and herbs for the ingredients. And all the colors are natural as well. Yeah, I was saying it's almost like you would have to use an artificial coloring to make this look so beautiful. But this <laughs> is all natural. And what are some of the more popular soaps that you sell here at the Soap Kitchen? Well, um, so obviously lavender, of course. Lavender is very calming and soothing. So we have many different lavender blends. But we also do many things with like tea tree, rosemary, peppermint, eucalyptus, all kinds of different herbs. And I picked these off the shelf because I, I felt like I needed this. This yes. is all. These are all like <laughs> the scrubby kind of yes, soaps, right? They are. They are. Oh, yes. Yeah, so we put poppy seeds in this one. And this is coffee, actually. This, Lots yeah. of ground coffee beans. I mean, it just smells like coffee. This is amazing. <laughs> And this one over here. The one here. This is with um, lemongrass with peppermint and cornmeal. So that's also scrubby. Um, what I think I, I almost love the most is that it's not just you that runs the shop. Here is your lovely mom. Hi. Hi, mom. You, you're able to work together, right? Yes. So talk about female owned. It's double female that's owned. That's right. Mother, daughter. Can't, it's nothing better than that. So, so, so who's the boss here? Uh, she's the boss. Are you sure? Is she the boss? I think so. <laughs> All right. By the way, the shop isn't open yet to the walking traffic. Uh, through the pandemic, they've been doing okay because people needed soap, right, during the pandemic. You can order online. It's thesoapkitchen.com, thesoapkitchen.com, if you want to take a look at some of this amazing stuff. I'm telling you, it smells unbelievable, Tony. You'd love this stuff. Oh, I, I bet it does. All right, Bobby D., thanks so much. Appreciate it,